Former President Bill Clinton made history visiting Paul Quinn College in Southeast Oak Cliff. He's the first former president to visit the historically black college campaigning on behalf of his wife, Democratic presidential frontrunner Hillary Clinton. The South Carolina primary is up next for Democrats Saturday, but then comes Super Tuesday. Fox 4's Richard Ray is at Paul Quinn College tonight. Rich. Hi, Heather. Of course, Texas and 10 other states do hold those Democratic primaries on March 1st, so-called Super Tuesday. But Texas is the biggest prize of all in that. And former President Clinton came here today to fire up the base and get out the early vote. America never stopped being great. We just need to make America whole again. America for everybody again. Without naming him, President Clinton took shots at Republican Donald Trump and his oft-stated plan to build a giant wall between Mexico and the United States. Hillary says, I want to build ladders of opportunities and tear down barriers so we can all be whole again. But before Hillary Clinton gets a shot at a Republican nominee, Trump or otherwise, she still has to get by the surprisingly strong challenge by fellow Democrats, Senator Bernie Sanders. And Texas is key to that with 252 delegates to the National Convention more than all the delegates so far chosen in previous contests. <laughs> President Clinton clearly fired up this overflow crowd. I definitely support Hillary Clinton. And it would be really great to have a woman president finally. But not everybody left totally convinced. I think she's the most, the best candidate that's president ready. But will I vote for her? That's the question. Hillary Clinton has a double-digit lead in pre-election polling here, largely because she has greater appeal among African-American voters. That makes historically black Paul Quinn College fertile ground for the Clinton campaign and her husband's legendary skills in retail campaigning. Of course, the next battle between Bernie Sanders and Hillary Clinton is this Saturday in South Carolina, the primary there. And as you said earlier, Heather, this was a big night for Quinn, uh, Paul Quinn College. First time in its 144-year history it's had a president, former, or current. All right, Rich Ray, live. Appreciate it.